if not better. So the odds are in, the evens are being placed away, and the green light goes on. This is race 11, the Nixon's Function Centre Stake. Into a dollar sixty-five now beside myself, set to go away. She missed the kick. She's got room to hunt up on the inside. Can she push through? No, she's checked, and she goes back. Winnipeg Jack's got the lead on the outside, Aztec Viper. Slave to Love showed more dash and burn across and took the lead. Favoured in trouble again there beside myself. She's trying to get into the clear. She bumped badly there with Howes at Marley, then end of Innocence. Here they come on the front straight. Winnipeg Jack's kicked back. Winnipeg Jack has kicked back to beat Slave to Love. Third was Aztec Viper. Uh, then behind those uh, in fourth placing, look, it was either End of Innocence or Beside Myself. Uh, then in turn, uh, behind those, we had uh, Howes at Marley, who went very wide on the bend. Shaker Breaker was always at the tail end of the field with Subjective Boomer. It's 4, 8, 5 and 6, 23, 41 the time. 23.41 the time. 8.99 was that early split. 14.42 was the run home. Yes, uh, look, it looked like Slave to Love had too much toe around the bend and burned it off. Uh, but Slave to Love went very wide around that last bend and just wobbled around the bend. And Winnipeg Jack just kept kicking back on the inside. Uh, look... In the early part of the race, there was three greyhounds going for the lead. Winnipeg Jack, Aztec Viper and Slave to Love. And the favourite was trying to push through underneath, but then copped the check. Then the squeeze come with the second turn, where Aztec 